What is good, everybody? It is Trey from My Damn Toys here, letting you guys know about some new pre-orders up on Ringside Collectibles right now, and we got some new in-package images of the brand new Ringside exclusive Hardy Boys, guys. So let's go ahead and take a look. You guys can see right here. Golly, stop, stop messaging me. So taking a closer look at the Hardy Boys, guys, I love this packaging to death. I think they look so cool in the boxes. I still do not have an image exactly of what they look like shirtless. Maybe somebody sent that to me. I, I can't remember, but I love the way this box looks. I love the Hardy Boys font that they got going on in the bottom left corner. They are going to come with the tag titles. I love the interchangeable hands. These figures are hands down. I think you could pretty much just go ahead and clarify that these guys are the, the best ringside exclusives that we've ever gotten, especially when you consider the fact that we've never had a two Two pack exclusive for ringside exclusive so I think this is really epic I love these guys to death I think they look fantastic and I cannot wait to pick these up I may have to grab a few of them you know make some different attires make some different fix-ups you know customize them a little bit maybe I, I don't know where the the possibilities are endless guys but you know that these are gonna be epic I can't wait to get them maybe down the line one day we'll get you know some other guy maybe we'll get some other two packs from ringside collectibles for ringside exclusives considering we're getting these you know the the, the possibilities are endless for future two packs maybe Maybe some Dudley boys, maybe some flashback Edge and Christian. I don't know. I just think it would be really epic, but I did want to show this image to you guys. We also have some pre-orders up on Ringside Collectibles, and they are the brand new WWE Elite Top Talents 2019. Now, I'm kind of worried because, you know, it is the same guys as the 2018 Top Talents Elites, but these are up for pre-order right now. And ringside, you know, it is April Fool's Day today, so I didn't want to, you know, mess up and po post this up and it end up being an April Fool's joke. But this is literally on their website, so if people go over to their website, pre-order this thing, are they just going to refund people's money? I, I, I don't see that to be true. I don't think they would do that. That's a lot of hassle and a lot of stuff that could get convoluted, and you, you just you just don't want that attached to your name. So I don't think that they're going to be, you know, April fully, full full fools this in around right now. I think this is legitimate, and I think that, you know, they're going to probably release the exact same Braun Strowman. I bet he has a Get These Hands t-shirt. Um, maybe, I don't know what Rollins attire they're going to do, but I hope it's, you know, one of his more memorable ones. I hope it's, like, I could see it being maybe the Thanos attire without the gold boot, you know, you know, the version he wore after SummerSlam where it wasn't the gold boot version, but it was the dual black version. I could also see it being, uh, well, that's literally the only one that I think it would be. It could be the Royal Rumble 2019, but I, I don't know, man. I think that's a stretch considering the Rumble literally just happened a couple months ago, so I don't know. I, it's going to be interesting. AJ Styles, I think it would be cool to see the lime green attire. I think that would be appropriate, whether it's the black and lime green or the lime green version itself. And then you have Finn Balor. I'm always up for a, you know, non-painted, non-demon Finn Balor. I love those figures. I would take any of the attires he has worn. I would preferably like one that I haven't customized just yet, but it's definitely possible that we're going to get one that I've already made. But I wouldn't even care. I would love it. I would love a like long beard version. The one, the beard that he's got right there in the image is the beard that I would like for my Finn Balor to have a, a head skin like that. You know, uh, to get many of those for Braun Strowman. Like I said, I really don't care about his figure. But for Finn Balor, Seth, and AJ, I'm totally all hands on deck for getting those figures. And I really don't care what attires they are. They're probably going to get picked up by me. And I'm sure I'll get the Braun Strowman just because. Just but, you know, I, I won't enjoy it. But anyways, we do have some WWE Basics top talents as well. And we're getting John Cena, Jeff Hardy, AJ Styles, and Seth Rollins. So you can apparently see that John, uh, AJ Styles and Seth Rollins are definitely top sellers. I mean, they get a figure every other series. John Cena used to. It just seems like they don't push him out as much, man. Maybe, maybe, that's, uh, maybe I'm just not noticing it. But I'd like to see if Jeff Hardy is going to have a face painted attire or if it's going to be a non-face paint like we got in Basic 92. I hope it's a face paint attire, maybe the RKO version or something cool. Um, would be nice. I think that that'd be cool to do some different elite fix-ups. I wonder if it's going to be those snake skin sleeves that you see in the image. That would be awesome as well. Seth Rollins, I don't know if we're going to get new head scans. Like, I don't know what, what they're thinking here. Maybe we get a new John Cena head scan. I guess if they give us the John Cena with the, you know, the, what, what was it? The, um, not the crown jewel, but the other one. The I can't remember what the pay-per-view was called, but that, that attire that he wore in the You Can't Stop Me t-shirt, I think it's one of his worst t-shirts he's ever worn, the navy blue colorway. If it's that, it sucks because you can't do an elite fix-up or, or conversion. So I don't know um, about that. If, if it's a new head scan and I like the head scan, I'll obviously pick it up. And then for AJ Styles, they'll probably do the same exact figure. 
that's in elite form in basic form or they'll do the opposite so if we get the black and lime green elite then we'll get the lime green and black basic i'm sure they'll do it that way we'll probably end up with the elite series 66 aj styles head scan uh, a lot of you know a lot of questions going up i would love to see images of all of these but i do not quite have them just yet so when i do get the images i will most definitely post them up to you guys so that we can judge them and crap all over them or praise them you know whatever the case may be but that pretty much does it for images and all the stuff here today, guys. We have the Hardy Boys pre-orders up. We got the Top Talents Elites and the Top Ta Talents Basics. If you'd like to pick up any of the figures you saw in today's video, guys, go over to Ringside Collectibles. Use the promo code MDTOYS to save 10%. And subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE figure videos. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at MyDamnToys. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.